Hello. Today's story is about a dog named George. Here he is. And the story is called Bark George. It's written by a man named Jules Pfeiffer, who also drew these pictures. George's mother said, Bark, George. George went, Meow. No, said George's mother. Cats go meow. Dogs go arf. Now bark, George. George went, Quack, quack. No, said George's mother. Ducks go quack, quack. Dogs go arf, arf. Now bark, George. George went, Oink, oink. You can see George's mommy is not too thrilled. Oh, no, George, said George's mother. Pigs go oink. Dogs go arf, arf. Now bark, George. George went moo. Oh, George's mother took George to the vet. I'll soon get to the bottom of this, said the vet. Please bark, George. George went, meow. The, do the doctor, the vet, the vets are special doctors for animals. But I bet you knew that. The vet reached deep down inside of George and pulled out a cat. Now, George, he said, bark. George went, quack, quack. The vet reached deep, deep down inside of George and pulled out a duck. Now, George, bark. Oink, went George. The vet reached deep, deep down inside of George and pulled out a, you guessed it, he pulled out a pig. Now, said the vet, bark, George, bark. George went moo. The vet put on his longest latex glove and then he reached deep, 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 down inside of George. He put his whole arm down there, it looks like. And he pulled out a cow. Oh, and a big cow, too. Bark again, George. George went, arf, arf. Well, George's mother was so thrilled that she kissed the vet and the cat and the duck and the pig and the cow. On the way home, she wanted to show George off to everyone on the street. So she said, bark, George, bark. And George went, hello. <laughs> I guess George has got a bit of a ways to go still. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed that story. I sure did. And we'll see you next time. Bye now.